Developing a flock with the right mix of genetics can take generations to perfect. But DNA testing has put Geelong sheep and wool producer Jack Briscoe on the fast track to success. Mr Briscoe is only a year into breeding his own merino flock after branching out from his sheep contracting business. He started by pulling together a mixture of 800 homebred and yard-bought ewes as his breeding base. So what I've had to do is start off from scratch. So what I've wanted to do is to get there quickly. So um, I need to know what, I've, what my base was to start off with, with in terms of um, fleece weight, um, body weight, and how they're going to growth rates, etc., to make the operation as streamlined as possible. It sounded like a daunting task, but it turned out to be much easier than expected after Mr Briscoe volunteered to take part in a pilot trial of the Sheep CRC's new DNA flock profile test. The test involves randomly sampling 20 young ewes for DNA testing. Genetic links are then made with animals of known breeding values from the Information Nucleus database. These linkages support a prediction of the flock's average breeding values, which are then scaled to Australian sheep breeding values, ASBVs, for major merino traits such as yearling weight, fleece weight and fibre diameter, as well as the indices for fibre production, merino production and dual purpose. It's so simple and easy to do. Um, when you get the pack, when it first comes to you, it tells you how to take your random samples, you know, how to make that every, everything's easy, clean um, and effective. And more importantly, the results have put Mr Briscoe on the front foot in developing a breeding strategy to improve his flock's productivity. I could see that my micron's really, really right up there. Um, it's above average. Um, but then I can also see that with that, that with having the micron that I've got to have the fleece as well. I've, so my fleece weight is down, so that was the first thing that we're going to work with with my stub with ASBVs. His immediate goals are to lift weaning weight and fleece weight as he moves towards six monthly shearing. Now I can go back to my new stud that does use ASBVs and together we can work out a plan of attack of a five year plan of where we're going to go with the flock, with our rams. I can see that this is a great uh, partnership that I can take on with my stud that I'm using now so that we can actually look at not only the sheep as a physical sense but we can actually underline what the whole mob is and how the most effective way for my ram purchase that I can use each year. Mr Briscoe plans to use the DNA flock profile test results in conjunction with the Sheep CRC's Ram Select app which he says will give him greater confidence that he is selecting exactly the right genetics to meet his breeding objective. So I think the thing is, is not turning up to a ram sale the day before or the day of um, and not having a clear sense of direction. Whereas now, three months in advance, the stud already knows the rams that are up for auction. Um, so they've got a better understanding of which my goals um, and they can earmark those rams out for me so that when I turn up on the day I don't have to look at all the rams, I can just go and look at ones that are going to suit my enterprise.